Hello everyone! Welcome back to my channel. Um, I want to say thank you for everyone that watched my last video. I am really trying to be more consistent with my posting. So yes, this is my second video here in Africa. And today we're going to be talking about one of my trips that I went to Mola National Park. So Mola National Park is actually found in northern Ghana. And I am in Accra, which is like near the coast of the of southern Ghana kind of and then so the trip to Mola like to drive directly would be like give or take 10 hours maybe like a little bit more a little less depending on traffic but it was a long trip when we actually I've actually been there two times and it's really beautiful it's definitely somewhere that if you come to Ghana, I feel like you should go check out because it's really a once in a lifetime opportunity. And I've been lucky enough to have gone twice since coming. And both times have been so special. I will include clips of what we did, being in Mole. And yes, overall it was very beautiful, like I said. Um, you see baboons, elephants, um, warthogs, antelope so many cool 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 animals and something really neat about mole national park is that it is not like the animals are kept in like cages or anything like that it's an open space and the animals are free to roam wherever they want because it is their home and we are just visiting both times i went i did a morning safari and an afternoon safari and one of them was walking and then one of them was went on like on one of the like the big cars like a safari car which was really neat they were both very different experiences um the walking one we definitely saw more elephants for sure one we saw more of like the smaller monkeys on the trees we saw much more antelope we actually saw a cheetah no not a cheetah um hyena and which that was really rare because they're nocturnal and we went during the day so it was really really neat i'll include a picture The second time I went, a baboon actually came into our mine and my roommate's room. And I wish I would have gotten it on video, but I was really scared. So every time you go into your room, you're supposed to lock the door behind you because the baboons can open the door. And usually I was in charge of locking up behind us, but my roommate um, was the last one to come in. So I just assumed that she did it. And she did not, so then at some point, uh, the baboon came and opened the door. And at first I was really excited. I was like, oh my gosh, who came to visit us? I thought it was someone else from our group, but it was not. And then I was staring at the door and I saw little furry legs coming in. And I was like, oh my God. And so it was really scary uh, once I realized and got over the shock that a baboon came in the room. I uh, immediately hopped on all the beds and I ran out of the room and I felt really bad for leaving them in there but then I was like, oh, like I'm gonna go find help, which I did. I screamed and I was like, everyone, there's a monkey in the room, like please come. And uh, unfortunately the help did not want to help because they were all scared as well. So we just ended up waiting for the baboon to finish going through our things and uh, let himself out.
So something really cool about uh, Mole is that you can get some of the National Park people to, you pay like 10 CDs and then they walk with you and your group to go, it's called sloping. And then they basically like, you sit in like a little tree and you just watch the elephants drink water and play, which is really cool. Thank you guys for watching another video. Please like and subscribe. Like I said, I'm here. I have so much content. I'm going to be posting more, so expect that in the few days to come. And if you're ever in Ghana and have the opportunity to go to Mola National Park, you definitely should. If you go, share your pictures with me. I would love to see. Uh, thank you. Vanessa, come say hi. Hello, this is Vanessa. Ha, <laughs>